So Ken Rogoff made an argument that, that he doesn't think that we're in safe hands these days. He didn't mention anybody by name. Um, <laughs> But I think you get a sense that he feels that not only, and, and Bob Rosenkrantz made this, the, the argument as well, that our alliances are frayed. Uh, China is not uh, necessarily a friendly interlocutor um, in the economic sense, and that if a crisis were to come today, they're arguing that we don't have the cool heads that would be able to handle it. Brexit, another, you know, also a mess, which is a serious partner last time. So, Neil Kashkari, take that argument on. You know, I was at Treasury from 06 to 09, and people may forget, in the middle of the financial crisis, we had a presidential election in 2008, Senator McCain and then Senator Obama. That was hardly political harmonious time. I mean, I was sitting uh, in the gallery above the House of Representatives when the House voted down the TARP the first time. I don't know if you remember, members of Congress were telling us their phones were ringing off the hook 99 to 1, <coughs> saying, don't you dare vote for this. Then the Dow Jones Industrial Average dropped 777 points that afternoon, and two days later they voted for it. Our democracy is deeply flawed, imperfect, but in moments of crisis we tend to come together. And I believe that in a moment of a future crisis, we came together in 2008, I believe in the moment of future crisis, American history has shown that we will come together and do what's necessary on behalf of the American people. That was what I lived, that was my experience in 2008. I think that's true today.